Hello everyone. In this video, we will look at the query dependency editor in Power BI. So for example, you're getting multiple, you're getting data from multiple sources and you want to see if there's any correlation between or there's any dependency between different queries. Uh, for example, you want to make changes and you want to see if it impacts any other query. So you can have a look at how the queries are joined or correlated using the Power Query Editor. A quick one, I'll just show you what I mean. So I've got Power BI Desktop open here with me and I'll go to Edit Queries and again click on Edit Queries. So I'll just show you, I've got three files here, 1.csv, 2.csv and 3.csv. They've got the same format, it's ID and name. So the first one contains one and JSON, second one contains two and Bill and third one contains, let's just change it to three and Lupin. So these are the three files. Now, if I want to see, if I go to view and click on query dependencies, it says there are no queries in this file, so there's no dependencies. So let's try to get these uh, files. Uh, these are CSV files, so I'll get the first one, hit open, and this, and I'll click OK. And now if I go to query dependency, it will show me one query. So it's saying one is dependent on 1.csv. So we'll quickly load the other two files as well. I'll hit OK. And now if I click on query dependencies, you can see that it's showing us that there are three different queries and none of them are uh, correlated or it, no query depends on any other query. So let's close this. And now if I select one, I'll go to the home tab and I'll append. So I will just not append as new, but let's just say I will uh, two tables and I will append two behind this and click OK. So it's got ID and name and now we've got these two queries appended. So let's see when we go to the query editor, what happens. So you can see one is now dependent on this and the second one as well. So you can quickly see the relationship. Now uh, let's, uh, let's again uh, click on one and go to the home tab and cl click on append queries as new. So we will use one and the other table we will use is three. And I'll click OK. And it's created a new query for us, append one. So let's see what if we go to the query editor, what happens. So you can see it has created a dependency. It's saying that, you know, two and this file combined to form one and then they're again joined to form another query. So it's showing us how a the various queries are dependent on each other. So as you add more queries, you can see the different queries and how they're uh, related to each other. And if there's no relation, it will not show any relation. So this is uh, the query dependency editor or where you can go and see the query dependencies in Power BI. I hope you find this video useful and thanks for watching this video. Uh, please do subscribe to my channel if you enjoy what I'm doing. Thank you.